I'm so excited. <laughs> morning hello happy tuesday <laughs> um it's a fresh week fresh face i haven't got any makeup on today because <clears throat> i got shit to do and that means i just want to crack on i've got lots of orders to pack so i'm going to be concentrating on that today um and yeah i woke up with a very 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 sore neck so i can only move my neck so far each side so i'm gonna have to be really careful that i don't make it worse today and then poor husbandos actually hurt his ankle so we're a right pair today um so yeah i'm gonna crack on i've got my packing station ready so let's get on with the day and get some progress made Something exciting's arrived! If you remember in last week's video, I um, <laughs> made my first order of holographic stickers and this is from Sticker App and this is the first time I'm ordering from them and I am so excited to open it! So let's just, let's just do it, let's do it! <laughs> Let me in! Let me in! Oh my god, hands, please. Please work, hands. <laughs> okay, right. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, okay. God, they're all holographic. Oh my God. Let me, let me take, take them out of the packaging. I need to, I need to see these up close. <gasps> they look so good. Oh my God. Wait, where, where are you? There you are. Look at the holographic! And then this one. There we go. <laughs> so these are for February's Patreon and I'm going to be packaging them up tomorrow and getting them all sent out to their new homes. Um, I also want to check on this one because I actually got um, some of the Biplanets made in the regular glossy vinyl just to see the quality of them and oh the colours look so good <laughs> the colours look so good I'm so happy look how bright the pink and the purple are that's honestly like the exact quality that I've been after for so long <laughs> So I'm so glad that they've turned out all right. Um, so this has by far uh, 
definitely made the choice for me to switch over to sticker wrap. The quality is insane. Like, oh, just look at that. Look at the hollow. I'm, oh, I need to make more hollow stickers now. Now that I've actually got some in my possession, they'll look so good. I cannot wait to send these out to my patrons. Um, and yeah, because I was upgrading them to hollow and getting them made professionally, um, they were all lovely and kind enough to be able to uh, wait just like another week for them to arrive. So um, I'm sending out the February packages for Patreon a little bit later than normal, but it means that they got to try and run my first ever hollow stickers. So I'm super excited for them to arrive with my lovely patrons. <laughs> I'm out of breath, I'm so excited. <laughs> um, and yeah, the glossy vinyl looks really, really good. I am very impressed with the colour and the quality. Um, yeah, by far better than I expected. So that's it, decision made. I'm going to be um, sorting that this week again. Again? No, wait, I'm saying the wrong words. I think I'm going to be sorting that this week then uh, by uh, sending out um, a load of I can't even remember what I was going to say. <laughs> Basically, I'm going to get my stickers converted over to sticker up and get them all made by them um, eventually. So I'll, I'll try to run a couple more designs and get like a couple each time. And maybe I can do that over the next like couple of months just to chip away and slowly convert all of them over to a nicer vinyl. So anyway, back to the regular scheduled order packing now that we've got that out of the way. <laughs> Hello, I'm back. I've got makeup on now, feeling much better. <laughs> uh, my neck's starting to feel a lot better now that I've actually... Every time I try to have a conversation, the printer decides that it wants to get involved. Are you done? <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so my neck's starting to feel a bit better now. I've had some meds, I've had some food, and I'm feeling so much more alive today. Um, yesterday, I pretty much had to take the day off. I was feeling awful. I had incredible fatigue, and I 
just did not have any sort of focus or concentration to be able to get anything done. It was very frustrating and I had a very rough day but I rested because that's what I needed to do and I'm feeling much better today because of it so I just need to keep telling myself that resting is actually okay to do because working for yourself is a thing that is difficult when it comes to needing time off or wanting time off because you just feel like you have to work all the time because you're the person that is you know running the business it's not going to run itself without you um and it's difficult especially when you're also dealing with a chronic illness and chronic pain so i just need to remind myself that i actually do need to take more time off than i think so yeah <laughs> also do you see this thing in the corner i have a new light um that i got from amazon and it's really good let me get the remote where's the remote what did i do with the remote one second i'll tell you i'll show you what it does so this is the remote and let's do automatic let me turn it off one sec look at it go so um yeah i obviously this room is still uh, a big work in progress and as you can tell <laughs> because there's like this big clump of uh whoops sorry ow there's this big clump of um mystery things under here which is just like random stuff that i still haven't gone through like all of my other metal drawers and things and i just haven't had the energy to go through it so um this room has stayed in this state longer than i was oh it's doing its own thing again um it stayed in this state longer than i want it to but i again i don't want to push myself too hard and end up injuring myself so it, i'll take my time with it i'll take my time with it i still need to put some pictures up on the wall as well i've got a lot of artwork to put up from you lovelies that have sent me fan art and i really really want to get it up um i need to decide if i want to frame them or not or if i just want to uh kind of washi tape them to the wall so i need to decide on that but it is stream time now i packed some orders i didn't have time to go to the post office beforehand i'm gonna have to do it later on so we'll go for a little um not midnight walk but late night walk later on to the post box because uh the post box near me uh they pick them up uh every morning anyway so me taking it now versus taking it tonight isn't gonna make a difference so i will do it after my stream and we'll go for a little bit of a walk so yeah let's do some streaming and do some arts Oh, how funny. I used all of the pink ink. What a surprise. There we go. You're still going strong, Pixma. Thanks, buddy. Good morning, lovelies. It is Thursday today. Um, so I've had a couple of days of just packing orders and kind of getting on with uh, catching up with that because thanks to you lovelies, I've been really busy with orders again, which is a good problem to have. Um, today's plan is first of all i've just put on some makeup um and it took me longer than usual because my arms are feeling very heavy today so <laughs> taking today step by step i'm not going to overexert myself um that's why i'm not showing you this side of the room because um we, <laughs> we we came across a very funny scenario yesterday and anybody that takes medication um will probably have experienced this before i couldn't find uh one particular medication and i was like oh I, I must have misplaced it somewhere i can't find any more uh maybe i've put it in a bag somewhere we literally pretty much 
turned the whole house upside down trying to find these tablets. Couldn't find them and I was like, great, cool. Have I thrown them away by accident? Like, who knows? Um, but I should still have another two weeks worth somewhere. Couldn't find it, rang them up again today. And I was like, hey, so I spoke to someone yesterday. They said that the last time I picked up some meds was the 25th. And they're like, um, Oh, and I was like, oh, because I, I can't seem to find some of my meds and I I need some more. <laughs> and they were like, oh, so it was the 25th of January when you last picked up some tablets. And I'm like, excuse me. <laughs> um, so apparently I forgot to pick up, apparently I forgot to order my repeat prescription last month. And I was like, oh my God, I'm so sorry. <laughs> So uh, luckily they've sorted the repeat prescription out to be picked up like later on today or tomorrow, but like, oh my God. <sighs> so that was the thing that happened. Um, it was quite funny and I'm very glad that it was my, my fault and you know, not like the people that have given me the prescription or whatever. So sorted that, I'm <laughs> gonna get some more meds uh, this afternoon or tomorrow. Um, and yeah i thought i'd tell you that funny story because it, it was worth sharing and i'm sure people that take meds have been in that uh similar situation before where you've lost meds and you're like oh what am i gonna do um but yeah i rang up and they were super understanding and she was like hey yeah i can just order you like another two weeks until like you have to reorder them and then she found out that yeah i didn't actually order them last month so that was hilarious um anyway little mini story time over <laughs> um today's plan is i'm gonna try uh print some more of my patreon uh prints for february's kawaii mail club now i've got my holographic stickers that have turned up from sticker wrap um so i can start getting those packs out now um i started printing some last night but i came across a uh an issue with my printer so basically it's printing lines um on some of the pages and it was very frustrating because like i i just bulk print and obviously i do like one test print to make sure the colors look okay and then i bulk print everything else because i have to print like 100 prints or like at least 50 sheets because then i cut them in half because it's an a4 size piece of paper cut into a5 um there was like the first lot that printed fine and then i looked over and i noticed that there was some lines on some of the prints and i was like oh god so luckily i stopped it luckily it hadn't gone through the whole um print cycle of like 50 sheets so that was good um so i'm gonna do a test print and just make sure the inks and stuff are okay and it's not clogged and then i'm gonna carry on so let's do that Printer, are you okay? I have never had this happen before. Um, I've dealt with like the the lines on the paper before, but like, what? <laughs> I'm gonna try another test print and see if it does it again. If so, I'm gonna go through more like diagnostics with it and see if I can fix it. So what I've been up to this morning is I've been trying to fix my printer desperately. <laughs> um, unfortunately, no luck so far. I've done a, a list full of things. I've uninstalled the drivers and reinstalled them. I tried making a new um, file for the um, prints that I wanted to print. That didn't fix it because it could have been a corrupt file. Tried printing various of the files, still did the same thing 
Whereas if I printed a PDF document, it printed it fine, as in it was just a document that like had labels on, that printed fine. I printed from directly from my Google Drive and that also printed fine, but it printed with a border. So then I tried fixing that, but I can't seem to get rid of the border if I print directly from uh, Drive, which is frustrating. Um, and then I tried printing directly from Drive, but then printing through the, the other print window. Um, and there's something going wrong there because then it comes up with that big like band missing in the middle of the print. I cannot work it out. Um, so what I did just in case I can't get it fixed over the weekend is I've um, sent off for uh, print postcards to be made basically by um, a company that I've not used before um but i've heard that their print quality is very good and they've got a really quick turnaround time so i got them sent off this morning i had to fiddle around with a pdf file because they um only really accept pdfs and like um adobe illustrator files which is very backwards but it's fine we dealt with it <laughs> so i've done that uh we'll see what they come out like i might actually also get them printed with another company just in case this company doesn't have a good print quality and that way if i don't get my printer fixed over the weekend i've got like two different stacks of prints to choose from that i can then um i can choose which stack is the best quality and then use that for sending off my patreon prints and a uh, reward pack thing what was it called again kawaii mail club there we go <laughs> um so i might investigate that later on um but for now, I wanted to show you some goodies that I got. Um, so I will bring you in close and I'll show you some goodies that I got yesterday, which I haven't had a chance to really look through properly. So I wanted to show off um, my lovely friend Liz's Patreon goodies because I actually upgraded to her uh, print and sticker club tier this month. Um, she's one of my bestest friends. I've known Liz, uh, also known as Zombie Octopus, that's her art name. I've known her for many, many, many years. And yeah, it was really nice to get these in the mail. So we've got this awesome, awesome print that is actually reversible, which is awesome. And these are some very cute Monster Girls. I, I love this like Eldritch babe very, very much. So I'm gonna try and put that up today. I absolutely love them. I love the character designs. And then there's a, a butt ton of stickers. So uh, I'll show you the stickers that actually came with this particular pack. Look how cute she is. She's so cute. And then we have this one. I love her so much. She's got kind of like Eldritch Shelly kind of vibe. She kind of, she gives me like shark girl vibes and I'm absolutely here for it. Like there's, there's the only thing that really indicates that she looks like a shark is her tail is kind of same kind of vibe, but I love her. And then there's some more cute stickers. So cute. This is one of her characters, Zoe. This is um, kind of like one of her mascots as she is a zombie octopus girl. She's cute. And then these are two of her other characters that are so cute. Look at them. I love them so, so much. The names of them have escaped my brain, but um, yeah, they're adorable. And I actually have the pins of them up there as well. And then we've got some special stickers that have some really fun effects on we've got some really cute fireworks we've got a really cool anatomical heart which also has uh, sparkles and then this really cool heart as well so i love you liz thank you i love all of your things as always so i'm excited to put all these stickers somewhere and put the print up today thanks liz love you So we are <laughs> parked on the side of the road uh, with the van. We wanted to go on a little adventure. Um, and the reason that it's loud is because we have some coffee brewing, which is going to be really exciting. We've got some little 
uh, snacks of pastries and biscuits and things and we've got this brew in the bag coffee that we're gonna have um yeah just to get out the house and we're nice and safe and it's really nice to be outside <laughs> oh there's a rainbow let me show you the rainbow Hello, update on the printer situation. So um, you would have seen me earlier on dealing with this really, really weird issue with my printer where it's just like not printing out the middle of the image for some reason. Um, good news, I'm not the only person that's experiencing this issue. So that actually means that my printer is not broken. <laughs> it's like um, a weird update and we found out that it's actually a Windows update that recently happened that seems to have broken um, at least this particular um, type of Canon printer because me and my friend Blue Fate, um, uh, also known as Kate, uh, she has exactly the same printer as me and she's been um, dealing with the same uh, problem and she actually looked on some articles online and they recommended um, rolling back to an earlier version of Windows, so before this update happened, and it seems to have fixed it, so we're going to try that. Um, and hopefully it fixes it because it's been a real big issue with me not being able to send out Etsy orders. I'm not able to fulfill these orders right now because I'm not able to print out stickers. I'm not able to print out prints or labels or anything. Um, so this is really good news and we're gonna tackle that tomorrow and I'm gonna work my hardest to get a load of orders out tomorrow and get them shipped. So good news, very, very happy about that. <laughs> it's working! Yay! So what it was, was a dodgy Windows update, which has come through in the past week. Um, I believe Windows is having some problems and all the other people because they've uninstalled Flash Player uh, and uh, stopped support for it. So I literally went into programs and features uh, and then uh, went at installed updates and ranked them by installed on and just to be honest took off the uh, the past week's worth of security updates now that is never a good idea once Canon update their software in a week's time you must reinstall the uh, software updates but it is working it was a bad update and we were able to roll it back. Yeah, thank you, baby. <laughs> and now you've got a full day of doing orders. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so lovelies, I'm going to leave this vlog here. As you can hear, that is a happy sound of a happy printer in the background. I'm so glad that we got it sorted. It means that I can actually crack on with all of my outstanding Etsy orders now. So that's what I'm going to do for the rest of the day. And I think I'm actually going to do an order packing stream on uh, Twitch today as well. Normally Normally on a Sunday I do a uh, sketchy Sunday stream but with the printer issues it's meant that I've been um, way further behind with Etsy orders than I'd like and I'd really like to just concentrate on those today and I know the few times I've done order packing streams before people have really enjoyed the, the like really chill vibes and it gives us more of a chance to chat as well um, so yeah I think I'm gonna do that today and if you haven't seen my Twitch streams before um, I stream four days a week on Twitch and as normally I will be uh, drawing live and you can interact with me live and it's like we're sat in a cafe drawing together it's really really nice chill vibes and yeah if you've never seen them before this is the kind of stuff that you could be missing S sorry say that say that again they're like yeah the last time you got your prescription was the 25th of January and I'm like 
and with that note i will see you in next week's video thank you so much for your continued love and support on this channel i'm working really really hard on this channel and i'm really enjoying making the content for everybody here and yeah please subscribe if you want to see more and like and comment if you leave a comment down below i do read every single one and i love reading what you put so if you want to do that it would mean the world to me and i will absolutely uh, love and appreciate you forever and ever and ever <laughs> and i will see you in next week's video thank you so much Mwah! and all, as always i nearly forgot to say it make sure you practice self-care self-care is very important do something fun for yourself do something nice for yourself i love you guys bye 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 What was he doing? <laughs>